welcome back to some more Voice of Cards. The Forsaken Maiden, there we go. Not to be confused with Voice of Cards, the Isle of Dragon Roars. The first game where this one, this one might be a soft prequel. Um, with that, uh, a uh, little bit of, uh, Easter egg in the, the previous, uh, previous stream, uh, the stream where we're going to be, I should say just this time, uh, we'll be heading up to the spirit spire, specifically the, uh, second, uh, the, the second one the, the second floor um, we're finally on chapter four I am hoping sorry no not one of my I want collection movies we're on chapter four so depending on how long chapter four is, how long chapter five is, there is a potentiality, depending on how long those two chapters are and how long I stream for, there's potentiality that uh, we'll be able to finish Your this by, at, uh, you to finish this this weekend. This very altar. The self-proclaimed spirit told you that Laddie could become a maiden if you brought all the maiden's relics back to this spire. Lack might be uh, actually uh, the, the, the end boss. The memories of the other maidens now reside within the relics as pure light. According to Lack, only a single heart scar remains. You need only heal it with the relics light. Perfect. I'm um so like with the sound of Lack's familiar chant in your ears, you once again enter the heart's domain. Um you see a door hold, hold on. within the blinding light. Not long after, you hear a voice. <laughs> For those for just joining us, joining us, um, I, I don't like to talk during narrative portions. Beyond the door lies Laddie's unconscious mind, the voice says, though you have no idea what that means. The voice then delivers a warning. A half-hearted attempt will only end in heartbreak. Let's see, would you still see what lies beyond the door? Um, so yeah, I, uh, this kind of got brought up on in a, in a, in a message at one point, uh, why I don't always talk. Sometimes, uh, sometimes I do talk during these sections, but more often than not, I don't, it's a, it's, it's because I don't like talking during them because not only is it so that people can hear, uh, what the story is, I haven't played these games, <laughs> so I would also like to know the story. Uh, obviously, but um, no, uh, so very, very few people. And I don't like to, I don't say I hide it. I just, I don't actively pursue um, show uh, sp specific shows anymore. But uh, for a time I was, I was, I, I would say it was decently into anime um, back in like, essentially what would be like 2000 five to 2000 2004 2005 all the way up to like a little bit into 2014 um recently uh under uh recommendations watched like the first two seasons of rising of the shield hero and uh first two seasons of overlord so like i'm kind of dipping my toes back into it but for a while there uh, and this this kind of goes into a little spoiler territory. Um, it's soft spoilers because I actually I, I never watched it, but um, 
For whatever reason, I do remember in like 2009 to 2012, uh, the, the magical girl genre was super popular. And there was a... There was a... You know, like Sailor Moon and... Really, that's the only big one that I can think of off the top of my head. <laughs> um, card Fight Sakura? It's kind of an older one. Um, there was one where... Uh, I think it was like Pula Pula Modula? Something like that? Where the, the main enemies were called Witches? Like the the main antagonist and um it like i guess it like turned out that the 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 entity it's like cat looking thing with long ears and like rings around its ears um was like the orchestrator of turning the turning girls into magical girls and then over time they find like it's a plot twist that like he's actually orchestrating the, the like he's actually evil and at the witches the witches are like fallen magical girls and it's just it was the whole thing I'm thinking we might have something like that here obviously there's a lot more story beats that I just don't know because I didn't <laughs> never watch that show but I, I know there's something like that in that show Pass through the door, make for the land of woe. There I will. Voice echoes in your head as your consciousness fades. When you awake, your mind feels hazy, and you find yourself wondering what that voice from earlier was. Laddie, noticing your distant gaze, looks at you in concern. You recall the voice telling you to make for the land, the land of, of woe. woe. With no other leads, you decide to do as it says. But yeah, it'd be a, it'd be an interesting heel turn, that's for sure. But I don't think they're gonna do that. Oops. I'll bring this over. Oh, is this what it was? Oh yeah, that's right, right within that timeline, 2011. See, I want to, I want to, I want to say it's uh, Puya Magi Madoka Magica, or it's uh, Pella Magi Madoka Magica. I don't know. I just know one of the characters. Uh, there's a there was a clip going around where one of the characters basically gets bit in half by one of the 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 antagonists, one of the witches. Like like straight like chomp bit in After half like that. Multiple heart scars with the help of the maiden's relics. Laddie's heart's domain. Is starting to return to normal. No, I gotta make sure that my. As you gaze around, your eyes become transfixed on an area in the east that is still shrouded in black. <gasps> it disappeared. Suddenly, the onyx stela begins to move. And goes off into the distance. Does, does it like fly move, or like did it go through the, the water like woe, like a fish? Way, Lack says. You decide to put your faith in its words, and chase after the Stila. Well, uh, well, how do I get there? Do I just is this a big spiral? Is that what this is? Oh, holy shit, it is. Okie dokie. Bruh. It's literally, literally the... I haven't moved. Oh, 
Well, at the very least, this will be good um, fight fodder for Lack to level up because I think he's he, I think he's like ten levels below us now, or about. All right, high roll. Yeah, seven's fine. It's it's average on on two six sided dice. Teamwork makes the dream work. Shit, I thought that would have been would have done enough. Got some fling. Fling flang. I'll water down. Mm. I guess I don't know, like, really. Oh, is it just like it's dirty? I don't know how to interpret water down as a as a status ailment. Dang, I should have attacked the other guy. Because <laughs> that would have been enough to take him out. Might as well just take him out. Get him out of the way. Magnificent. Kind of feeling stupid. Should have. Should have. Uh, <laughs> should have. Should have attacked the guy. Should be enough to take him out. There we go. All right, some decent experience, please. All right, all in all, not too bad. It's like, what What do we got? Wow, I can't believe we're in like the 15,000s. Yeah, they I've, I feel like there's been a. Increase in. Um. What is it? Uh, it, 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 it yeah, increase in the ex how much experience you need to get into the next level. Yeah, might as well. Well, at least it still gives me damage. Attack four. See, it wouldn't be so much of an issue if I could actually beat these guys quickly enough. Definitely does seem like uh, they do put emphasis on um, teamwork makes the dream work. These abilities that increase your attack is is um, something that you ought to be doing more often. Uh, and actually, to a point, certain certain instances we had to. No, stop! Don't attack him. I just I just healed him. I don't think he's gotten any new abilities since. Oh, 
Excuse me. Um, since we've, um... Damn. Oh, I was, I was fishing for a better, better attack roll. Oh yeah, it, I, I definitely am decrying the amount of... The, the the lack of um the what you call it the the blah blah blahs <laughs> the stat increases I find the grayscale really cool on the overworld. I just wish that they didn't grayscale the edging of the like screen border. Like it's a super cool effect, but it's a, it's a little hard on the eyes. Oh, they're called the gazing. Ooh, creepy. Oh shoot, I was gonna take out Tri Attack for Grand Slice. Hope you win. Ooh, good. Deadly poison, please. Attack down's fine too. Oh no. Okay, good. I, I need Laddie to be able to heal. Because I really, really do not want to um, have to use a salve. Good. Fortune favors the bold. What is going on? Ooh, defense down. Yes, please. That darkness resistant, that's always nice. At this point, I guess I should just do basic attack. All right, he can, he's fine. He's fine if he doesn't have his abilities. the bold. Yes, it do, it seems. Hmm. There we go. Yeah, see, now that's some of the, the um, stat increases that we've seen last in last game. We'll only ever see it on on lack because he's never with us. Also, too, he doesn't get any equipment. It's kind of a big a big thing. Oh, 
Ooh, I don't know. Fifteen? Perfect. Fortune favors the Ooh, and wind down. Start working on the other guy because as soon as I get to Baron's, I'll use the air thrust to take out to the. I actually don't know what. I haven't gone into the uh, the monster portion of the collection to figure out what some of these characters' name or uh, monsters' names are. Honestly, I should. Oh, come on. Some decent damage, though. Do Thunderbolt. He's weak to fire. Interesting. Kind of looked like a demon baby. the encounters are truly random or is it a set pace like I'll, I'll like when I'm in the hearts domain I'll get a random encounter after a random encounter regardless after so many steps versus like I'll have a random encounter randomly as I move through a, through a, a place Eh, that might not be worth it. Yeah, might as well just take him out. Baron, I don't think you have the... Sure enough, as soon as I take out the, the crit uh, ring, I seem to be critting more often. Well, that was a waste. And he doesn't really have. I was hoping for a six. Six on that die roll because Uh, this deal damage does not uh, the the add value of two dice rolls does not get added on to that first part of the damage which honestly it'd be kind of nice for that to be applied first two fight is one and then go through it all hell yeah yeah because yeah, we're now we're now at the point where we should be for stats but we're we won't ever be this way because that's that's last game stats we're right where we need to be for this game stats not a big issue I'm just enjoying the uh, OST the soundtrack. I guess they made the soundtrack for this game, so wouldn't wouldn't all video games be OST or uh, all soundtrack video song video game soundtracks be all OSTs? I wonder how that works. What what's the qualification break there? Trying to not break myself. Oh, let's see here. We decent enough? No. Get all the 
Honestly, it's not a bad thing. I just, I fight every fight. Oh, bolt down. Okay, cool, cool. I, I can work with that. gonna be five extra damage. Ooh, nice. Um, my guy, I think you should groom. I think um, I think Baron needs to get hit like one more time for it to be worthwhile to um, to use a, a an Omni uh, one of the um, multi heal salves multi target heal salves. Hello. You managed to catch up with the Onyx Stealer. Just where do you think you're going, you ask, as you give it a tap? When... Oh, it explodes? The Stealer transforms into Queenie and Blight. Interesting. Queenie, who appeared on her head for reasons unknown, tumbles to the ground with a yell. A concerned Blight helps the maiden sit up. It seems she can't shake her misfortune, even in this world. Uh, yeah. I mean, she died but during you know childbirth. Oh, well, she died after giving birth. But you know that the Onyx Maiden died in childbirth. You so there you go, there's your recap. ...are just illusions made by Laddie's heart. Well, it's a good thing that I fought with Lack when I, when I had the chance, because now I have two people that oh good I do have it the thing is does can I equip them I can just really need something for defense or the extra extra gem give him the extra defense all right so i should have been equipping rings to the other maid uh, to the other people uh but i i really i was land of woe unsure is of anguish it is a pit of darkness into which sink her deepest darkest desires my, what a curious little desire you have with you, an elderly woman remarks. Something about her strikes you as strange. Hmm. Lack, suddenly on the opposite end of that woman's stare, angrily retorts, My name's not desire. The woman explains that the queen has ordered all her subjects to keep black shadows called desires as pets. Okay. Only with greed can you proceed, she tells you, before mysteriously vanishing. Oh, she vanishes into the wind. Her enigmatic words leave you with nothing but questions. To find answers, you know you must explore the area for yourself first. I mean, oh shit, I knew it. Two, four, five, six. Well, she got a. Oh, they got a little bit more uh, attack now. I 
think you're supposed to have uh, Krim and... No, no, no. Two fight is one. Well, maybe. Maybe, maybe if you did... Um... No, that wouldn't make sense, because this, this is the Onyx uh, spirit place. Try to clear it out. Ooh, what are those? What are those? <laughs> we have, it, sounds, it looks like we have a couple speed ties. Teamwork makes the dream work. I think Queenie went before Blight in the first one. Yeah, because I just did a, a normal slash. So they have a speed tie. And then I think I have a... Uh, Baron has a speed tie with Laddie. they got like attack power so that's always good Does the skeleton have resistance? Is that what the issue is? I just, I'm missing it. I mean, yeah, I know it's got like two more extra health, but like. Oh, that's his desire. It's like something Once to. Once he notices Laddie at your side, he grows angry. How oh, dare he's one of those guys. Inside a woman, he rages. Oh well, he's gonna actually fight me. Oh, dude, you're gonna. And. Oh. Um, two desires are gonna fight me. Oh, it's because it's his two eyes. I don't like how the grabby hands are supposed to like represent the uh, the ocular nerve. Two fight is one. Yeah. 
Do value roll. We just do a slash. Laddie's just last. Oh, let's see here. Oh, shoot. I should have charged with her so then I could use... Uh, and then double heal and then Queenie, sh Queenie or Blight should be able to take out what's that? I think they're called gazers That was a uh, that was a boss fight. The shadow melts into your body. His desire gone. The man glares at you with disdain. Greedy jerk. He scowls. Interesting. Interesting. Enemies stop appearing. Become less frequent, please. Five or higher, so that means that. Well, I mean, it's not too bad. I'm, I'm getting enough uh, starting mana crystals that I'm doing these. Uh, Maiden skills, uh, so like I'm taking taking stuff out faster. Two fighters one. Because I I have the the mana base for it, so I, I guess it's not too bad. But it would be great if I didn't have as much. Ooh, treasure. Okay, I'm, I'm less mad now. damage off this oh but I don't think they have similar uh, defense never mind two fight is one Ooh, a chest. Oh, hell yeah. Nice. Now, if I run into a particular situation, 
I now have two of them. Don't hold back. I'm surprised that thing was able to fight first. Wasn't. Is there a, a three way tie for speed? Pulled up, pulled up a thing real quick, just to double check. So there is a slight variation on the RNG of the attack. Oh, that's great. The attack number seems to be more of a suggestion than an actual number, similar to the damage numbers in many Pokemon games, but those actually have a formula. Players will deal a range of the attack number, deal a range of the attack number rather than the attack number itself. This RNG algorithm is not shown anywhere in the game, but players will see it when they begin calculating damage attempts. Uh... <sighs> yeah, it's... If it's at least a range of it's at least a range of plus uh or it's it's at least a range of a deviation of one to two with it weighted on the deviation towards the negative if that kind of makes sense. I thought I would have fought these guys uh, enough time to unlock their their flip story. Magnificent. Let's see here, Laddie, Thunderbolt. <laughs> Hit him with the thunderbolt. The thun. Th th How do you do that cadence of that all? The thunderbolt. Right, you. Hit him with the thunderbolt. Nah, he. The English, uh, <laughs> English voice actor, the original Lieutenant Surge in the. Behind him, English dub of Pokemon. Uh, kind of seemed like he had a mobsterish, mobsterish voice. Alone, would you? He says, trying to shoo you away. No. We must defeat you and take your desire. Become your desire. Oh, cool! The things that look like fucking Coromon from Digimon. Should learn how to play that. There's a apparently a, 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 a store near near me that uh, uh, supports um, Digimon TCG play. Supposedly it's it's pretty good. Or I should actually uh, take the steps to play it over Discord. Apparently there's a thriving. Uh, online version being played that you can play over Discord. Oh, inflict curse? Ah, whatever. Just don't inflict it on Laddie and we'll be fine. 
because Laddie has that ring that gives her five health. Is it five? Yeah, five health every turn. Just don't. I just don't want to heal. Kill him. Damn it. Fortune favors the bold. Um. Magnificent. Wait, what am I doing? I don't have. Ah, uh, I'm an idiot. I forgot that I don't have Grand Cross because I'm pretty sure I'll probably need Tri Attack. Phone on, uh, not on silent. And that's just not a stream thing. I always have my phone on silent, much to the begrudging of. That was a three mana spell. No, fucker. God damn. I was hoping, hoping to like not. Shit. Ah, uh, okay, whatever. Thunderbolt. <laughs> I think I need to actually just remove the basic attack at this point. The shadow melts into your body. His desire gone, the man squats down in place. Damn, you're greedy, he sneers. You hear what sounds like a lock coming undone. Perhaps a door has opened somewhere. No, we will become even more greedy. And probably fail the quest because we're too greedy. What am I looking for? I am looking for oh, uh, skills. I'm looking for skills. Oh, shit, oh, I hit the wrong wrong button on my controller. Um. Okay, so yeah, air thrust is gonna be our standard attack. We're gonna pull up grand slice. Really anything else? I mean, there's that. Starlight Veil. Two, four, six. That's six. Oh, jeez. Um. Nah, you know what? I'm gonna have her have Starlight Veil. Because if we ever have six on Laddie's turn, it's because we really needed to have six on Laddie's turn. What's your deal, stranger? You see an elderly man. He then hmm. looks at Lack and licks his lips. Ah, you'll make a fine dessert. He murmurs hungrily. Interesting. Ooh, two times gold. I can I can deal with that. Oh, you got? <sighs> Wish it was two times uh Try out Starlight. 
These are probably like undead equivalents. It's like, how cool would that be? All right, cool. Starlight Veil. Oop, yep, see, it's light. It's light base attack. Ooh, it's like an Aurora. Teamwork nice. Makes the dream work. Hush. Just stop being cringy, GM. Helm Splitter? Oh, I, I mean, that's that's kind of like, um, oh, what was uh, Levea's thing? Unfortunately, you also don't have, have an AoE yet. Charge. <laughs> Two, four, six. It's AOE and it's attack plus 20 with a, a bonus to defense. I, I don't think I don't think I can ever say no to that if I can if I can do it, I can do it. Especially since they're weak to it. Oh yeah, look at that money. Hmm, hey, finally some an attack up. God damn. The shadow melts into your body. His desire gone, the man begins to drool. Your greed is insatiable. He spits in disgust. But that's like the whole point of this is that we're supposed to be greedy. Just don't know if I want to fight these guys. That's a Sometimes it is just fat a little fat it's just faster to run. Oops. Interesting. A familiar knight and young girl face each other. Their desires beside them. Interesting. They recognize the pair as the Crimson Maiden and her attendant. It looks like they're making their desires do battle. My desire is the strongest, Lavia shouts, getting fired up for the fight. It certainly looks very tough, Queenie remarks. Pray Lavia blushes and rubs her nose bashfully. Behind the two maidens, Gladio's desire claims an easy victory. Hmm. Interesting. I thought we would have I thought that we would have seen them before. Shit, now I have to fight. <laughs> All right, well, that's fine, because I think if I... Easiest way for me to fight is to hit the bowling pin baby and do Blight's AoE. Hit. Oh, I didn't do. Teamwork makes the dream. Push it. Oh, he does go before them. Well, at this point, I might as well charge. She'll just gain five health back, and then I'll... Hmm. 
why didn't she gain five health? Was it at the end? Oh, it's sorry, it's at the end of round, not end of her turn. All right, Hellfire. Oh, the value of three rolls. Okay, so here, that's even better. Jeez, I want that ability. That'd be a nice ability to have forever. It's a really strong ability, so I understand why they don't want <laughs> the kind of basically benched Queenie. I guess I'm not escaping. All right, next person's turn. All right, let's try this again. We'll be back. There's the door. Oops. Oh, I bet you this is the the locked. Oh, oh, okay, okay, yes. Now I can actually see if the um, maiden attacks do criticals because this will be a guarantee should be a guaranteed critical based on the happenstance. Oh, it doesn't. Okay, never mind. You can't critical uh, get a critical hit on that. So, uh, so that makes me a little sad. But it does make sense because if with all the uh, linked maiden skills that I that I've used, you'd, you'd think I'd have a I'd crit at least once. A woman looks inside of her wallet and sighs. The woman turns to you and exclaims, I am sick of being poor. The shadow behind her. Did we just get reverse mugged? Because I mean, we were fighting her. We we're going to fight her for her. Uh, for her, for her thing. And it kind of seems the bold. They are fighting me. Let's do that. Let's buff them for next round. Because I think these guys are also weak to light. Defense down. Defense down should be minus five, not minus four. Cool, I can actually, I can dig that. Fortune favors the bull. What did, why don't, eh. I mean, they, they walked right into my... <laughs> they unknowingly walked into my plan, just as planned. Ooh. Is that like my ultimate skill? Interesting. 
The shadow melts into your body. Her desire gone. The woman glares daggers at you. How greedy can one person be? She asks with a scoff. I I rather have that deal attack plus ten. That power charge would be nice, but if you do if you don't roll. Because then, if I if I run into an issue where I, I I'm being re resisted on status ailments uh, or not uh, uh, elemental attacks, I can still that's not where I wanted to go. Let's see here. Magnificent. Teamwork makes the I wish I could get a slightly better setup with uh, with Laddie, but I'd have to have at least I'd have to have at least one more skill slot. The door exudes a sinister aura. When you touch the handle, the aura dissipates. I threw the gate in the, the land of woe. Opens. Yes, I just hope the map isn't as big as this last one was. Cause that took a while to go get through. No, it's it's even bigger. All right, well we're gonna pick a side. There's a there's a three way tie. Should be able to take out the fairies, but the snake lady maybe not. That's getting distracting. Teamwork makes the family's blowing. Uh, got people blowing up the family chat, and I don't. Thinking. They can, they can, they can deal with that. I don't want to be distracted. <laughs> the rep tent. That's pro that's what it's called. Ooh, interesting. Well, there's that. So we can't go anywhere until we fight that thing. Magnificent. 
forgot to... I thought I was prepared to have no distractions in my stream space tonight, but I keep forgetting about weird shit. Forgot to turn off my work phone for the weekend. Was not expecting to get a a notification email this late at night. On a Friday night, I should say. Okay, so we got it. We have the fight, Harpy Lady. Shadowy desire suddenly leaps at you. I mean, it's, it's got a. Got a sleek design. And fight. They are thunder based. So. Oh, wait, shoot. I shouldn't use. Let's add 10 for his next turn. Because it literally is just add 10 to his next turn. Ew. Good and missed. We got eight, two, four, six, eight. Yeah. We'll use two to use this. Nine, what was that? Twelve. And the crit. Noise. Starlight Veil. Unfortunately, it's using her attack stat, so maybe it's not the best to have on her, but it's two fight is one. There's really not a good. Oh shit, that's right. It, I can't have attack up and defense up, so that's where that's that's what that's what the issue was. Um. Healed one. Okay, and this will see if it has a weakness to air, which it does. Good. Oh, let's see here. I'll need Queenie to go first. Need him. I need her to beat Blight in the speed tie. Assuming speed isn't dictated at the start of the encounter but we'll do hurricane we'll that wind damage on all enemies I think that'll, that'll take it out. Yeah, why not? That's a, that a very weak three, a three six sided die roll. Three D six and you rolled a six? That's a nice experience. Too bad I need like 1500 experience. Just as the shadow dissipates, 
You hear a door unlocking in the east. It sounds the door exudes a sinister aura. When and then we touch it to handle, open it. The aura dissipates and the door opens. Four is not too bad of a of a of, of a flea chance. Proceeds to roll snake eyes. What is this room? Is there not? What do we got going on here? I don't know. Do I even want to fight these guys? He's gonna go. I'm gonna use elemental element of darkness. It's two four. Tempest. Okay, overkill with the crit, but that crit was cool. I like I like these these the the crit the critical critical hit animations for for this game. This is a, let me guess is this a goes to a door? Where does it go to? Goes to a treasure chest, which I will happily take. Oh, got two, two. No, no chance, no chance of not, not escaping the battle. Yeah, I wonder what's in the chest. Quality Omni Sal, perfect. I'm not gonna say no to more health items. Okay, so there should be at least the shadow glares at your party. Then suddenly there should be at least three more or two more of these. So this one and an another one before going into either the top layer or something. Nice times two experience on a boss fight. I can dig that. Oh shit, is it wind or is it fire that they're weak to? Teamwork makes the dream. Oh, I don't remember. That's not that's not cool. All right, let's see if it's wind that they're weak to. They are not, but it does do quite a bit of health. And the issue is that Queenie doesn't have an AOE.
magnificent. I'm trying to think if we've seen that move crit before this instant. It probably, we probably have, I just didn't notice it. Oh geez, almost 5,000 experience. Oh, if only every battle was times two experience. Just as your battle ends, you hear the faint sound of a lock coming undone. I don't like how I'm it seems absorbing. A door has opened. The door exudes a sinister aura. Um. When you touch the handle, the aura dissipates and the door opens. Like, yeah, I don't like how it's it's weird. It's ominous. Like how much of that is sticking with us? And when I mean sticking with us, I mean what? How much of it is sticking with 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 Baron? Go down. Oh, I guess I could play with these guys. They got small enough health pool that should be fine. Teamwork makes the dream work. Damage must be calculated per individual instead of. Especially with an AoE, it's not calculated at one time, it's per individual hit, which. <laughs> I mean, it's fine. A little silly to do it that way. But then again, you might come across people who have. or you'll have. Uh, mixed defenses and uh, the amount of defense that something has does dictate how much you could be hit for. Inspelixer, perfect. It's about, what, what was it? 750, 8, 850 that I didn't have to pay for? Fight him off. Nah, I think I'm gonna run. I need a six? Yeah, well, whatever. Whatever. Fine then, if you're gonna make this hard on me. Not necessarily, like, it's not necessarily hard, but it is, like, come on, like, these guys are obviously weaker than me. To be 100% fair, Queenie and Blight are kind of carrying my my team right now. Come on. There we go. I knew we were running somewhere. Blocks your path. You ready your weapon. Prepared okay, there might actually be three more. I thought this kind of expanded out a little bit more. She's 94. Holy caboli. Um, please do not be resistant to darkness. Teamwork makes the dream.
Critical but not weak. Okay. I can deal with Seal being on uh, Baron for a little bit. Actually, wait, no. He has no new attack. <laughs> it's Seal on. Oh well. Baron is now my mana battery. That's funny. Yeah, we're gonna charge there. Laddie's gonna get her turn and then she's wearing a Starlight Veil. Oh, it's six. Crap, I, uh. I miscalculated. not be able to even actually use um might not be able to use starlight veil i may have to be, do a uh, double heal just to do get well actually wait who, who who's at what oh 17 out of 42 yeah i would have just used an omni salve if he was uh just a few hit hit points more but Oh, I can't even do it anyway because... Well, I guess we'll be doing an Omni Salve after, after this combat. I, I couldn't even... I, I guess if you seal one, one person, even though they're there, they can't interact with another person's made an ability. Which makes sense. I get it, but also doesn't feel good. As the shadow disappears, you hear a door unlocking in the east. Did I not unlock his thing? I thought I got him from a boss battle. Uh, let's see here. No owned items. Quality salve use. Yes. Oh, that's fine. The door exudes a sinister aura. When you touch the handle, the aura dissipates, and the door opens. All right. This is just so... <laughs> really just want to um, make sure that I'm getting the okay yeah we're we're running I'm not I'm not dealing with I'm not dealing with quadruple speed ties okay yeah I mean blight blight went before Queenie so I'll, I'll take it because I should be able to get the Fairies. Yeah, right then and there, fairies. And then Queenie should be able to take out no 18. Well, if I use a use this. No, that that was only if I could crit. Okay, so that one hasn't gone yet. Barry has, so if I get that one taken out, Barry can't do anything before its next turn, because Laddie will be next. Laddie will hit it with a Thunderbolt. Yeah, so definitely, um, so far from what I have, from obviously what we played through uh, for this one, it's, it's, 
it it seems more what's the word I'm looking for uh the the story does seem like it is more like because like the first game it was either it was it was silly you know there was silly parts there was sad parts there was uh kind of creepy parts for a lack of a better term um however there it, it seemed like parts of the story were a little disconnected um whereas this one it it seems more well put together comparatively speaking um Teamwork makes the dream. But damn, it's sad. There's a lot of sad, sad stuff in this one. Just overall, a more sadder, sadder tone. Um... And that just, I don't know, it's just, that feels more... Feels more classic JRPG than anything. You see a man accompanied by a shadow monster. The shadow swallows the man. You start to wonder if all the shadows here were humans engulfed in desire. Maybe. While you are lost in thought, the desire rushes at you. Their desire desires uh, outgrew them. Would have really appreciated the uh, times Hope two win. defense or times two uh, XP rather than money. And to the point of the game that I don't really need a lot of money. Teamwork makes the. charge two four five charge six there we go cool starlight veil I like that. I like that Aurora, the Aurora um, edition. Okay, good thing I did that. Attack plus 10. Ugh. Gross. Okay. Yeah. Would have been real. It would be much cooler if you uh, took more than two. Two deadly poison damage. Dang. <laughs> I don't know, maybe this? Honestly, I'm only keeping the, uh, the fire attack, fire coverage and it seems like the wind the temp the tempest is just gonna be a, a much better spell to use if I if I'm at three mana on Baron and I want to use the skill 100% oh my god that is the worst thing you could have done literally the worst thing you could have done would love to do Just do a standard hit. And then elemental darkness. Yeah, it does it to all all enemies. It's got a long animation. I can't say no to plus fifteen to the attack when they have defense down. Yeah, 
There we go. Now I don't have to worry about it. Hey, Lady leveled up. Guardian, add five to all enemies' defense for three turns. That would have been a little bit better to have, uh, like four, or about ten, or five levels ago. After slaying the desire, you hear a noise from the south. That it sounds what this like is? a new path has opened. Good. Yeah, it, if if we were able to have gotten that at about. Show them what you got. The, if, if we got that like as we went into the onyx maiden's tail that would have been perfect um there's just the fact that i have a a, a mana battery of, of this work uh, of this like i have ways to to get mana i'm wearing equipment that gives me additional mana why can't i go here oh i bet you i go down and then come back up I think I'm, I'm trying to think on things to teamwork makes the dream work like strategies to like oh what's the fastest way to beat this combination of enemies but it's, it's really not working out too well with the slight RNG swing of damage and the fact that I can't remember half like I can't remember most of these creatures And honestly, that's my that's a that's a me issue, <laughs> more so than the game issue. Uh, lots of the a lot of the uh, monster designs super good. Issue is is that I just got a I got a, just a poor ass memory. <laughs> really interesting. Okay. So we'll continue on for another 25 minutes. So at, at, at about the two hour mark for the stream, we'll uh, we'll pause and take a break. Um, so I'll just have that prepared. There's just like sections of this that I can't figure out and that's going to bug me. combat combat simple that's that's the thing that i've i've been liking about these games is that yeah they're a little slim slim pit slim pistic. yeah see there's this four here that i just i can't interact with and that's gonna bug me a 
black shadow bars your path. As it turns its yellow eyes on you, your party readies their weapons. That's that's the wrong one. You, you did the wrong one. I want the the experience. to fire which is decent um, for boss fights two fight is one I think I'm gonna do Mirage slash to get the bonus in attack Mirage burst excuse me Seven. Seven's fine. Just because I like the AoE damage more than... Uh, I, feel like it, I feel like if I can do more AoE damage, it's better than just doing straight, like, heavier single target damage. Especially when they fucking heal. I forgot they did that. and then do Tempest for wind damage. Uh, attack plus 10 wind damage to all enemies, and that should take everything out, because that'll be 37. That'll be about what he did. Assuming, and then also assuming I don't crit on top of it, too. Ooh, hey, level. Eh, one more health. I'm not going to say no to, like, a level. I just wish that it had more than health. I feel like they're bad, like fire emblem rolls for stats. You find a faint <laughs> humanoid stain where the shadow once was. It's it's a weird feeling, that's for sure. This point, I don't think I really need money outside of curatives, <sighs> which might be the downfall of me, because <laughs> I I may run into a situation where I need to go out and buy those uh, tier two rings. I'm sure it would give decent experience, but like, I just leveled up. Laddie's probably ha at this point halfway through a level, which is sad because that might actually be halfway through a level for her. <laughs> That's 17,000 experience points. Oh, it'll be gross. I'm doing two what is it it's uh two no it's uh it's like about 350 experience and I'm at 17,000 
let's just say 400. So that's, that's a little closer. So it's like 400. 10 would be 4,000. 20 would be 8,000. I need like 40 battles and that's just random encounters to level up laddie one more time essentially 45 at this point it's just it's more time plus six okay well there's a if there's the if, if there if there's a high if it's a high chance um that i will not flee i'm just gonna fight him off Especially with this, because I can take him out in one turn. Except that guy, fuck that guy. Hanging on by one hit. Wasting my time, wasting his time. Only delayed his death in a matter of seconds. Okay, well, I, I, depending on what the, the creature is, it's like about four four to five hundred experience so I, I'd still need like 40 like 30 to 45 enemy oh, encounters okay. Ooh, box cards I'm I, It'd be interesting uh, to hear the. A black shadow bars your path as it turns its yellow eyes on you. Uh, the history of why uh, two ones on a on a die. If you roll two ones on two dice, uh, it's called snake eyes, and then rolling two sixes are box cars. That might just be a Midwest thing. I feel like I feel like Hellfire might be better. With a yeah. And then we got the 14. Like the the fact that we get deadly poison on top of that. Magnificent. Oh wow, that didn't do. I'm sorry, what? Why didn't I get the attack increase? Did her, does hers not do an attack increase? I thought hers did an attack increase. Magnificent. So I was like super stoked. I'm like, damn, 11 uh, attack? I mean, yeah, the deadly poison's nice. I'm not going to say no to that, but like, I thought add th value of three rolls. Oh, add value of three rolls to the attack. Add deadly, flick deadly poison. Okay. A little different. Okay, I got I I miss I misinterpreted that skill. But both of them now have deadly poison. That's kind of cool. I just wish I had a better one mana attack. Dice roll is just not good. Fortune favors the bull. I would have had it. I would have preferred a uh, deal attack plus you know, the plus four. Okay, it's going to be a significant amount of life. Fucking. Stop draining my health. This is some of the most. Uh, yeah, it's it's 
I've, I've stated my opinions on that before. The fact that there's, uh, Magnificent. you know, not only are you losing ground on the health aspect, but they're gaining it back and dealing damage to you. Excellent. Excellent. Uh, Rust, I guess. It's either that or charge. And I was hoping you would have critted. Because then there might have been a chance that it died from the deadly poison. So then now we gotta deal with him draining life. One. Roll good, this should take it out. And then I don't have to worry about it again. And then we absorb his power. Her power, its power. Humanoid stain where the shadow once was. I found the upstairs. No, the throne room? Is that where I need to go? Okay, I'm gonna explore this a little bit more because that should be... Cause that looks like that's going up. We're not going into... <sighs> Whatever. Probably that's the, the, the lady snake thing that's uh causing issues. How do you have one health? I, I thought you, it, I it could have sworn it did the exact same amount of damage to the other one. chance they also have their card things anyway actually wait I might not have a large suit stone okay cool might be cell fire Even is up with this. Weird. Okay. Oops. There we go. Enter the throne room. Does that go descend or? I can't tell. Now see that one looks like it descends. So we went upstairs. What business do you have in the throne room? Know your place. You can hear the desires ridiculing you. I fight you.
You're in the presence of the queen, you fools. You ignore their scorn and continue forward. We have absorbed more powerful beings than you ever will be. You just hope, don't hope that. What is this? What is this? That silhouette. It looks to be waiting for someone to sit upon it. Oh, so is she? Within the throne room, the Queen of Woe oh, okay. awaits. The oh no! Reveals herself to be none other than Laddie. Oh, okay. Never mind. <laughs> she is the undisputed ruler of this domain. Indeed, this world. I thought it was a uh, instance of uh, like a silhouette of her mom. Because that's what it kind of looked like. Uh, I never thought there would be any greedier than I in this land. Her voice is husky. Almost as if it had been... Her voice is husky. Almost as if it had been swallowed by the stormy seas and echoes within your heads. Okay, so you may have heard him, like, stop and then repeat... That is actually a part, that's actually a thing that can happen in the dialogue of the uh, the game master slash narrator. It's supposed like, he's like, it's supposed to be like that he's stumbling over his words. I feel like it, they did it better in the first game because it was less noticeable. This sounds like it's a, it's a record skipping back and then playing through. Because so I can hear the... That in the, the cutoff of woe, greed is both grand and glamorous for stealing the desires of my people i sentence you covetous intruders to death she decrees I'm gonna fight a dragon the impact sends you flying by the time you look up you realize that the entire area is covered by a heart scar. This looks bad, Blight remarks in a trembling voice as he gets to his feet. Heal the heart scar that has appeared near the queen. Or is the queen the heart scar? Yeah, she is the heart scar. I hope. A shadow larger than any you've seen Ooh, before. Ooh, cool. It's like a king slime. The heart scar. Summoned by the queen's screams, the shadow roars. Its voice. Um, how is this supposed to roar if it doesn't have lungs? Before lunging at you. Or what? What's that argument that like sh uh, that like Jaws is like the movie Jaws is kind of is like just really weird because the shark roars and sharks don't roar. Come on, because you got this. Uh, great. It's going to be one of those days. Hopefully you can get inflicted with deadly poison. So that would be actually really, 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 really helpful. Something tells me it's not. It is. Two fight is one. Yes, two fight is one indeed. However, generate one. Twenty-five water damage. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Oh wait, no, that bypasses defense. Oops. Okay, quality salve it is. How many salve? It is stackable. Interesting. Okay, so darkness attacks do more. Just do these. 
Perfect. The more crits that I do, the better. The faster this goes. We can just do a standard shadow bolt. Interesting. Resisted the... Charge spell. Ooh, nice, nice, nice poison. Here's water damage. Perfect. Cool. Unfortunately, they're still frozen, which means they're going to get a hit. Do light. See if it's weak to lightning. That was actually. Ew, that was actually that was actually really poor. Um, poor damage for a, a thirty. Uh, or uh, for a three, three, um, for a three, three attack thing. Okay, we're gonna hellfire. Get some nice damage added to it. Get deadly poison reapplied. I think on Blight's turn, we're going to do an Omni Cell. Yeah. So that'll be max for everybody. attacks, huh? Three. Oh, I don't think we ever used that yet. Some decent damage. This is out on the freeze. Perfect. This will be 35. Fortune favors the bull. Yes, it does. Fortunately, well. I feel like it's unfortunate, but also fortunate that Laddie is the mana battery, but I kind of feel bad. Jeez, we're, we're just taking this guy to town, unfortunately. Yeah, actually, lightning, lightning strike, a lightning attack would actually do more. Oh yeah, 33. That actually might take her out. Ooh, it missed. Charge. Five. Mm 
We'll charge again. Deadly poison should go away, and so does his attacks. We'll do Hellfire on hers, because I, I, I'm really liking the... Ooh, that is so good damage. That might take him out. So we're at 36. There we go. Never mind. <laughs> I was not expecting the roll like two from Max. Ooh, look at that. Oh, look at all that experience. Oh, no level. That's a shame. Unable to maintain its shape, the gigantic shadow begins to sway. Yes, we are this powerful. Is it, you shout and raise your sword in sync with Laddie's magic. Ooh, we're gonna get an ultimate attack. But the queen appears and blocks your attack before it lands. Damn it. This shadow is a manifestation of Laddie's greatest doubts. The queen worries over what will happen to Laddie's heart if that shadow should disappear. Uh, she'll be fine. The queen decides to ask you a few questions to dispel the doubts at the heart of the domain's crisis. Sounds good. Riddle me this. <laughs> what medicine does Laddie hate most? Did we ever? Did, did that? Was that ever a thing? Hold on. I don't care. I'm not. I'm, I'm. I'm. I know I'm cheating a little bit by looking up the answers, but I don't think we ever. Uh, I don't think we. Unless if, if unless if it's been that long. Okay, that makes more sense. Never mind. Wrong, the queen says with a laugh. How pitiful that you don't even know Laddie's likes and dislikes, she scoffs, before moving on to the next question. It's because Laddie's a mute. She can't voice this. What monster does Laddie fear most? None of these. We fought all of these. Actually, to be 100% fair, this was the worst one out of all of them. No, no. The queen, how cold-hearted you are not to know what she fears, she chides before moving on to the next question. Answer me this, who does Laddie hate most? And I'll be like... None of them. Are you sure, meaning? Because it almost made me cry. <laughs> you have no idea. The queen's desire to eliminate you is readily apparent. You don't know if there was, but she has proven her point. Perhaps you don't know. I cannot leave Laddie's heart in your hands, she roars. Interesting. That raging voice transforms into a tidal wave that rushes. Swallowed by the wave, the phantom onyx maiden and her attendant vanish. You're pulled under the toe only seconds later. Oh, there we go. Here's Lack. Unfortunately, Lack's... Ugh. Lack needed to have... Um, he, he needed to get a little bit more. When you come to, it seems you were expelled from the heart's domain by the queen. You see Laddie snuggled up to Lack near the altar. You decide to go check on them. Okay, got to speak with Lack, but I'm going to see Laddie first. Lack Never lies mind. There limply, like a stuffed animal without its filling. Well, there's no hand in them. The self-proclaimed spirit risked its life to save you. If you had been swallowed by the wave, your consciousness may never have returned. Don't be so reckless. You express your concern for the exhausted Lack. 
Lack trembles as if tries. Laddie gazes upon the injured Lack. It's oh. coming. Lack proclaims in a faint voice. And then, and then he disappears in a ball's light. Balls quiet. An odd energy fills the spire. You place Lack upon the altar and head outside to find the source. So Lack essentially died. Died to save us. I mean, it, it was bound. It was bound to happen. Unfortunately, I don't feel like we did too much with Lack. I think I think it would be nicer if Lack actually was a part of the party the in the tales too. Still. Almost you realize that the strange energy you felt earlier is not only in the spire, but blankets the entire aisle. Feeling a tap on your shoulder, you turn to see Laddie as Peggy points. And when you turn to see what she's staring at, you find your field of vision filled by a monster. Whoa, that's so a cool looking design. It pierces the clouds. It's raging toward you, tearing through the sea as it does. You can't believe your eyes, but you know you can't stand still. We have to evacuate everyone, you say. Then make for the village. Yeah. Why would you? Mm. Okay, I guess there's a sale going on. The merchant says they're having a fire sale. Everything must go. Anything that I want. Ring of life. Ring of life would have been nice. Pick up gemstone ring. I'm good on that. Invasion, I'm good on that. I I think I think I'm good. The merchant says it's time to move on and begins closing up his stall. You cannot shop here anymore. So the beast to end it all has finally reared its head, the old man remarks, calm despite the impending day. Aside from mm -hmm. the odd crying child, nothing seems amiss in the village. Nobody seems the slightest bit bothered by the monster Omega Village which has been without a maiden for years, seems overly accepting of its fate. You decide to speak with the mayor to learn how you might evacuate the people. You only hope he can be swayed. Yeah, that's, um... Oh, you know what? I bet you why they stopped you from being able to jump is so you can jump, can't jump to the other islands. It's been ages since you've seen the mayor. And yet he averts his eyes the moment you enter. Yeah, this is really weird. Someone, there's like a, there's, there's something else going Just on. Just like the other villagers, he seems to have accepted his fate. But why? We have so many. Uh, yeah. Yeah, it's just, why are you just waiting for the end? You ask him why everyone is stubbornly just waiting for everything to come to an end. Because that is this village's fate, Grief answers simply. No, Grief, Grief, oh, you know what? Grief. You if there is a way that's, that's to evacuate the village. Probably the word but play. But he tells you there is no way off the island. You ask the mayor about the giant monster. He says it is called the Isle Eater. The Isle Eater? How does he know that? According to the Maiden's Men, oh, there we go. the Calamitous Beast has appeared since times of old to devour islands. You have learned nothing for all your effort. Perhaps feeling the same, Laddie rushes to the village. You ignore Grief, who tries to stop you both, 
and chase after Laddie. It seems unlikely that the villagers will flee the island, which leaves you with no choice but to slay the monster yourselves. Is that even possible? <gasps> Normal person versus kaiju battle, go. All right, we're gonna take that break now. Good time to take a break because we're leading right into a, a big battle. Um, hang tight, everybody. We'll be back shortly. 